Well, good morning. Good morning. And welcome to another episode of SPI Chamber Today, coming to you from absolutely gorgeous South Padre Island. It is absolutely beautiful oh, today. It is. I'm Alita Bagley. I'm the president of the South Padre Island Chamber of Commerce, and this is my sidekick. Oh, I get to be sidekick today. You're not a, you're not a criminal I'm today. I'm not a criminal today. Yay! Yay. I've made the big time. I'm Diana Harville. I'm the marketing director for the Chamber. Well, we hope you all had a fabulous 4th of July holiday mm -hmm. celebrating this amazing country that we live in. We had so many activities on the island. My goodness, we had yes. firework shows every night. We had a, a beach 4th of July parade. We had live music everywhere. We did. We had concerts at yes. the amphitheater. We had concerts on the north end, south end, in the middle. Right. It, it was, was wonderful. It was fun. And we hope all of you were able to be here and enjoy it. Um, let's see, Diana, what have we got? Have we got anything coming up with the chamber? We don't ever do we anything. We don't do anything. No, you're no. right. You're right. Yes, of course we do. We have lots of things going on. But the one thing I want to talk about today is a new benefit that we started a couple of months ago called 12 at 12. Oh, wait. Before you do that, tell them your, your new slogan. Leaving money on the table. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's a good one. I couldn't sleep last night. Okay, so this is a 3 a.m. thought. You would never leave walk off and leave table or money on the table so don't leave your benefits, benefits on, on the table. table exactly i couldn't see i couldn't remember my new slogan i should have prepped her for that yeah no it's a good one and no, she is right you wouldn't leave a hundred dollars sitting here on the table right and walk away so why would you not utilize your benefits that's right now i'm sorry that's, to interrupt now you no, can tell them about 12 at 12. but 12 that play that's it's good because mm -hmm. that plays into 12 at 12. um we're buying you lunch yeah for 12 of our closest friends or 10 mm -hmm. excuse me 10 of our closest chamber friends mm -hmm. that being whoever signs up first mm -hmm. uh may was very successful we got great reviews off of that first class and the second one for july is already full mm -hmm has been for a couple of weeks. Oh, yes. Right. And uh, August has been scheduled. It's mm -hmm. August the 16th. Mm -hmm. So be sure and go online and sign up before that class fills up. Mm -hmm. We spend some time going over the uh, benefits that you have via our website through your member portal, mm -hmm. uh, marketing, some things that we do for you, some ways that you can even help us help you even better. And then we sit and just brainstorm mm -hmm. and problems that you're having is there something that that we can do you know maybe somebody in the room has had the same thing and has some suggestions mm -hmm. but it's an hour long we do not hold you past 12 and like i said and we're buying lunch past one past one sorry. so be here sign up <laughs> sign up early now for august before it gets full and we will want you here at 11 45 we will feed you lunch yes. Uh, catered by Carlos Catering, one of our wonderful chamber members, and you will learn a lot. You really will. Um, it's very good. So uh, we hope to see you there. Hope you sign up. Uh, then, of course, we've got the Ladies Kingfish Tournament coming yep. up. So if you haven't registered for that, make sure you do. Don't forget that we also have a youth division now, girls only. Uh, for 10 and under. Right. So if you've got a daughter, a granddaughter, a niece, your boyfriend's got a daughter, anybody at 10 and under, please sign them up for the youth division because it is a lot of fun. And it's it a great is. way to spend time with your kids right. out on the water. So, um, and it, Ladies Kingfish Tournament is the 12th through the 14th of August. So you right. don't want to miss it. Um, I guess that's it. We've, we've got people standing by and they're probably getting bored listening to us. Nah. Yeah. Probably right, so. so time to kick you out. Man, yeah. is there ever going to be a week you don't kick me off? Well, you know, we talked a couple weeks ago about some someday I'll just interview you. I don't know. Yeah, it was, I you know, know, got thrown out there. Never mind. Forget that one. Get out of here. All right. Get out of here. Well, we I'm are. On. Okay. See you next week. All right. Bye. Thank you, Diana. Um, today, we are meeting with a company that all of us need. Now, I hope you know that the Chamber of Commerce, we are terribly technologically advanced. I mean, you can go on our website 
and renew your membership. And you can go on our website and join the chamber. Hint, hint, if you are not a member of the chamber, you need to join now. But you can go on to our website and you can do that and you can pay with a credit card. If you are a sponsor or if you are buying merchandise from us, you can pay with a credit card. So all of us either either have credit cards and if you're a business, more than likely you take credit cards. And uh, so that's what we're going to talk about today. And I would like to introduce Broderick Banks and Dion Haynes. I get to sit in the middle of two good looking guys today. It's okay, Dean, don't be jealous. Um, so we are so happy to have you guys. And uh, why don't you tell us, why don't you start Broderick and tell us a little about yourself and what you all do. Uh, well, uh, my name is Broderick Banks. Um, I am with Wholesale Payments. We are merchant services. Um, we deal with both credit card, debit card, um, POS systems, the whole shebang, and uh, we just do our best to, to try to give uh, great benefits to, to all merchants and customers and, and clients as well. well. That's great. And? Dion, sorry. Um, we actually... Uh, Dion Haynes. Haynes, we're, there we go. I'm an account manager as well. We help oversee some of the accounts here on the island. Mm -hmm. um, we're part of a subdivision called Absolute Merchant Solutions by Wholesale Payments. That's where you can find us using the Members Plus app. So if you guys have um, any questions or any concerns, or if you guys just want free estimates, you guys can always reach out to us on that app and uh, direct message us, I believe. And you can also go to the face, I mean, uh, website, yeah. spichamber.com, yes. and you can find them there as well as all of our amazingly, incredibly smart, wonderful members. Um, so, Broderick, tell me, okay, because we do now take credit cards here at the Chamber, I know how much it costs every month to pay those credit card fees. And yes, yes it is a convenience, of course, to be able to take credit cards, but you know, it can get, it, it can get a little expensive, especially for a very small business like ours, a nonprofit. So, um, is it worth it to shop around? And and are your rates? I mean, are there competitive rates out there, or is it pretty much just one rate all across the board? Just depends on who you like better. It's 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 always worth it. Um, you know, and my motto, our motto is everyone's happy until they're not. <laughs> right. You know, so there's always a time. Um, where you know you shop there's a slow period you shop around see what's best what works best for you specifically now generally speaking we can save uh, most merchants about 35 percent um, over overall of what they're cu currently paying on their billing um, and I tell everyone no there's no difference between us and any other merchant it's just the amount of savings that they're willing the merchant is, is willing to to I'm sorry the account manager is willing to to get rid of on their part, how much fat we're willing to trim on our end. And as you can see, I got a lot of fat. So, you know, we're definitely always willing to work with, you know, merchants and try to give them the best possible um, scenario for their business. Sure. Well, I mean, I, I met these guys, I don't know, how long has it been? It's been almost a year. Almost a years. year. And both of them, when they walked in, Diana and I were both like, we really like these guys. I mean, they were seemed very knowledgeable they were very personable i mean they hung out you know we finally had to kick him out of the office but um so you say that it really doesn't matter who you go with it's how much you save but dion don't you also doesn't customer service and relationship have something to do yes, with that absolutely every time you have a problem or an issue with your systems you definitely want a face to be able to call and a number someone to pick up right away and most merchants or most business owners usually we'll have someone that will hang around for maybe a month or two and then they'll disappear mm -hmm. you'll never hear from them again you'll get stuck on the phone for hours upon hours trying to reach through an automated system you know trying your best to reach just someone to talk to Ugh, and we all hate that that is a headache and yes. that's why we take care of that for you guys mm -hmm. we are the face that you guys can either love and kiss or we're the face that you guys can hate and slap and slap there you but, go <laughs> that's you know, brave <laughs> yeah it is but it's a consistent face mm -hmm. and and that's what we're, our job is to do you know we've been checking on merchants for almost 
two years now on this island and some of them they just like to see our face even though they don't really necessarily go with us or they come and ask us for advice or just to check on their free estimates just to keep their other merchants whether they're lo keep them faithful keep them honest mm -hmm. and if there's ever a time that they cease to be around for their for their business owners that's what we're here for right that's you have right. to be one-on-one -on -one, like you said personal and then if there's ever any tech you know technology problems like you said we we, we have to be always in the forefront trying to be there for them and help them with that ever learning technology right well, we all know customer service is top priority because we live in a tourist destination. And mm -hmm. so we're all trained to give excellent customer service, to be that face, to have that smile mm -hmm. and go bend over backwards to right. serve people. So yes. it, it, I'm happy that you all have that attitude. So they're not going to say, okay, yeah, I want to go with, you know, wholesale merchant services and then you're gonna never you see Broderick or Dion again that's not gonna happen uh, with them I can right. I can promise you that because like I said we've seen them a lot and sometimes we have to throw them out so um, so uh, let's see what else was I gonna ask you um, gosh you guys are really good you did it you did it all up front so what's the next step that someone okay I have one more question so you know, technology is changing every day. Yes. How has this process changed, say, in the last year? Does it change as often as other technology, or is it pretty? Um, it's it's kind of, it's, it's a little mild. It's in between. With the whole entire COVID process that happened, a lot of um, business owners weren't prepared for tap to pay or mm -hmm. contactless payments or being able to have majority of their stuff. Um, paid for online so having like online terminals or shopping mm -hmm. carts set up and what we try to do is go out before those things or before events like that happen and and help customers or, or, or business owners uh, kind of beat that curve so we're always pushing we're always um, having meetings and business meetings with other technology companies to help them uh, push that product ahead mm -hmm. and having you know, options available for business owners whether they be in retail restaurant uh, lodging services mm -hmm. uh, pushing that technology ahead and and really showing those business owners what we have and what we can produce for them right, and right. Make it because that's your business yeah. and so when you know a customer signs up with you they've got their business yes so they expect you to keep on top of things and let them know when there's something new coming down the line yes. or you know something's happening mm -hmm. uh, that's so important because they they don't have the time right so many of our businesses are small businesses mm -hmm. they're working 12 hours a day and you know they just don't have the time to keep up so and that's that's generally what we're here for um to to go in and be your eyes and ears um your job as a business owner is to to take care of your your business you don't have time to worry about headaches or worry about why this isn't working or why this is messed up. That's what we're here for. That's why we provide that personal service. And um, we also try to initiate um, new upcoming things, which mm -hmm. comes to um, one of our newer um, things that we've kind of, our company has spearheaded. It's called Cash Discount Program. And you're seeing it probably all over the island. Um, it's where, you know, customers um, or business owners now take the power um, back into their own hands to be able to uh, not have to pay those credit card fees each month, that big bill that they usually have. They're able to use that money to bring back into the house and, and you know, whether it's renovations for homes or, or lodging or whether it's new equipment for restaurants, you know, they can pay their light bill or whatever right. the case may be, mm -hmm. you know, by saving um, those hundreds or thousands of dollars each that's month for that's, credit that's card fees. That's fees, that's right, fees. right. Yeah. Okay, so um, I just want to thank you guys for being here. I hope you all got some good information. Uh, they are chamber members, and of course, we as a chamber are very proud of our chamber members. Uh, you know, we've, we might have turned people away in the past because we might have been someone we wouldn't be proud of, but we are, are proud of you guys and the work that you do, thank and you thank so you so much for coming today. If you need to get a hold of them, you can call our office, 
you can go on the chamber website. Uh, that's how you need to do it. And then we'll let them know. Oh, and their member app. Yes. Yes. That is a very great app. There you I, go. I enjoy that app a bunch. Good. Good. That's the chamber app. That's right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and if you come to 12 at 12 in August, if you sign up for that, you'll learn about that. So, <laughs> all right, guys. Well, thank, thank you very you so much. much. Thank you. Thank so you. Much. And y'all have a great day. Yes, and we'll see you at our next, next week. Yes, ma'am.